Zuma blocks Ramaphosa's presidency. Former President Jacob Zuma's Yumkonto Wisiswi Party MKP has filed an urgent application with the Constitutional Court to hold the first sitting of Parliament scheduled for Friday. The initial session of Parliament is crucial, as it involves the swearing-in of parliamentarians who will then elect a president to form a new government. MKP is taking Chief Justice Raymond Zondo, Parliament Secretary Zolal George, and others to the Constitutional Court, asserting that the first sitting will lack a quorum without its members present at the swearing-in. In a two-part application, MKP requests the Constitutional Court to urgently consider its application and to interdict Friday's first sitting of the National Assembly from proceeding. In the second part of the application, the party seeks a declaration from the court that Zondo's and George's conduct in proceeding with the sitting is inconsistent with the Constitution. MKP also wants a declaratory order stating that the National Assembly is not properly constituted if the first sitting comprises fewer than 340 members and no more than 400 members who have not been sworn in. Additionally, the party wants the Apex Court to annul the Electoral Commission of South Africa's IEC declaration of the elections as free and fair and to mandate President Cyril Ramaphosa to call for another election. MKP Secretary-General Sam Gubain alleges in his affidavit that there is a potential tally of 590,000 votes affected by discrepancies. Gubain contends that the matter will ultimately reach the Electoral Court. And thus, a new president cannot be elected before the issue is resolved. Parliament will continue with the sitting unless interdicted by the Constitutional Court. Please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information or updates on news and entertainment.